Okay, before we get started with the video, I wanted to answer some comments that you guys left us. These comments I'm gonna be asking them for our latest videos. Okay, so my little cousin commented, Hi Daniela, you are my best cousin, cuz. And official Aaliyah J replied to her comment saying, that's disrespectful. She said that's because that's our other cousin, Aaliyah. And James William commented, beautiful. By the way, these are all in our new hair video, so go and check that out. And when he said beautiful, I'm not sure if he meant our hair or the art that I showed later, but anyways, thank you. In our Splash Mountain Log Sinks video, oh, Smiler Flips commented, the boat probs sank due to the age of the ride. The rides have issues when getting old. If it was re-themed, the ride would break constantly. Um, <clears throat> I agree with the first part. I think that the boats are like, I know I mentioned in the video that the ride is probably getting us back for, for it to be Princess and the Frog, but um, with all, in all seriousness, I can't think of any other reason why that log would have sank other than it was getting very, very old. They should have done something about it a long time ago, but they didn't and now, you know, it, it caused people to sink. I mean, luckily no one was hurt, but I do think that that was a problem that Disney could have easily avoided. Then Smiley Flips added another comment saying, at Sister Travels, Disney have safety issues. Any other time, I would have fought this person over this comment, but now, due to recent events, I agree with them. There's been like a lot happening at Disney World. And it's not safe. I think everybody should go to Disney World next year and just leave this year out. 2020 is just gonna be known as the worst year ever, so. I do think if the ride was rethemed, they would remodel their logs. Maybe not make them look different, but they would probably add some newer logs in there. I don't think they would keep the same old ones because they want to avoid the problems that they faced now. And lastly, my Disney face mask video, Mega commented, that is really fire. Buy mask and make more. Mega is also our cousin. He has his own YouTube channel called Mega and he does really awesome stuff there. He's so cool. He has changed so much since the last time we see him. He used to look like this. But yeah, thank you, Mega. I am going to make another mask. I'm gonna paint my mom's face mask. She wants Beauty and the Beast. I'm gonna do that like literally today. You guys will see it later. Hi, welcome back to Sister's Travels. I am doing this by myself. Um, I just wanted to show you guys like my little small collection of like Disney things, like mainly Tsum Tsums and stuff I've collected over the years. Um, I'll first start off with my collection that I have of uh, my, my little Peter Pan Tsum Tsums, my Tinkerbell ones and then my Maleficent ones, and then I have like this little collection that I got over here of Kingdom Hearts stuff. I'm still growing that one over there, so like it'll get bigger over time. So I'm gonna first start off with my Tinker, my Peter Pan one. Okay, so this was, um, I got this glass when I went to Disneyland with um, my family. We went on a little tiny mini vacay, and um, it was like, I got this literally on our last day while we were there. Um, I thought they were closed and then I was saying to myself like I didn't even get any really good souvenirs and so they stopped uh, we stopped at the shop and then I saw this glass I felt like this glass like literally it literally caught my eye I thought it was so pretty and so beautiful so I was like I have to have this glass so I ended up getting it and then um, I ended up getting this um, they gave it out for free if you bought something um, there and at the time when we went it was during Halloween time so I got this fidget spinner and it has the three hitchhiking ghosts on it and then I like it because it like lights up so I don't ever use it like I was not one of those people that like constantly had a fidget spinner in my hand even though I I I have like four of them but I never really like used them too much <laughs> So there's that. And then um, I've been collecting these Tsum Tsums for a while, um, actually. So the one that I, the ones that I have here, I think out of all the Peter Pan ones, this one was like my first one. 
Like I got this one, like this was my very first Peter Pan one. I, the, um, the Tinkerbell one actually was my very first Simpson ever. Um, the next one I think I got after that was this one here. I actually got this one out of a blind pack, like one of those uh, packages where you get three Simpsons and you get a mystery one. He was in it. He wasn't the mystery because I saw him. I don't remember who was the mystery. I don't remember. <laughs> Um, I actually made this one out of Palmer clay um, yeah this cupcake I made the base of it and then I had um, did a swirl of a cupcake made the hat and everything with the little feather there and then I also got this Tsum Tsum here this keychain one this one was not one like easy to find um, I liked it when I saw it and he has the winky face because I got a Tinkerbell one with the winky face and I actually got the Tinkerbell one first. I don't know why she was a lot easier to find than Peter. I don't know why. <laughs> I can't tell you why. Then I got this big uh, Peter Pan one. Um, I got this one. Oh, I want to say I got this like maybe two years ago. I, I When I first saw it, they said he was big, but I didn't like realize how big it was until I got it, <laughs> so that's, that's a big one. And then I'll move on to my Tinkerbell. The Tinkerbell one collection you'll see, it's actually a lot bigger than my Peter Pan one. Uh, this is actually the very first Tsum Tsum I ever got. Um, I played the game way back in, was that 2014, I wanna say? And I saw them and I thought these were so adorable when I played the game for the first time. And I just said to myself, like, oh my God, do they have, uh, you know, ones that you can actually purchase? So I looked around and I only saw like Pooh Bear and Mickey Mouse and Minnie Mouse and stuff like that. And then I was all sad. I was like, because I really wanted to get one. And then I actually found one and I bought it immediately. I was so excited when I got it. And then I ended up with two of these because when I ordered this one, it said it was a keychain one. But this is not what I thought they meant when they said keychain. But nonetheless, I have her. And then I got this little squishy one. Like I went on a, a, a whole binge of buying little Tsum Tsums. This came out of a, one of those little packs too that I got a Peter Pan one out of. Um, this is the Tinkerbell one that I had got with the winky face and that's why I had her match with Peter. Um, I got this keychain, uh, Tsum Tsum Tinkerbell. Um, I liked it when I first saw it, but one thing I didn't notice when I per like ordered it online is that the wings are a bit defective and they are put on backwards. I didn't notice that until I actually got it and I was like, why does her wings look so weird? And I realized they were backwards. Um, this is uh, the Tinkerbell and the Lantern. It usually comes with pixie dust around it, but for some reason I just cannot, it just doesn't stay on, so I just took it off so I could not lose its pieces. And then um, this was the very first lip balm by smackers that i got uh, i have a maleficent one as well but i got her first that's why she looks a little banged up than the maleficent as you will see this one is uh i think this one's peach flavored uh and then i also got a matching tinkerbell one up to the peter pan one it's big so i actually got her first and then so about time i got peter i kind of knew what i was in for <laughs> okay so now i'm gonna move on to maleficent Okay, so this was actually the very first Maleficent Tsum Tsum I actually got. Then I eventually got the dragon one of Maleficent. And then I got this, um, this is the uh, Maleficent Tsum Tsum lip balm. This is a berry. And I like the way these are because you can actually like snap them onto each other. Let me see if I can do it. Okay, so yeah, they like stack up onto each other. But I only have two, so like the stack's not going to be that big with me. Um, I got, I actually recently got this one. She's really, really little. And then I have like the dragon version of it too. Um, I got this one. This one was literally almost nearly impossible for me to get. There's a dragon version of this, but I don't have it. It's so hard to get. I don't know who has it. If anybody knows who has it, can they let me know or like leave a link or something in the comment section but like this this little Tsum Tsum I'm not gonna kid you it, it was very hard to find um oh I have this okay I got a bigger version of the Tsum Tsum of Maleficent and not gonna lie she is a lot bigger 
than the Peter Pans and uh, the Tinkerbell. Like she's, she is way bigger. So I, when I first ordered her, I expected to be the same size as Tinkerbell and Peter, but she was much bigger. And I was not expecting that. And then I remember I went on for days just walking around with her on my head. Oh, I forgot to point out that I actually have a, a Peter Pan little blind keychain that I got. I actually wore this with me with my lanyard when we went to Disneyland here. Uh, um, I actually still have my ticket inside my lanyard. Oh, this, yeah, this, this went with me to Disneyland. Um, I also have a Maleficent. I have a Tinkerbell one too, but I use the Tinkerbell on my car keys. And uh, this was the Maleficent one that I have. I've had this keychain for a while, and but I didn't have like a lanyard attached. So I just recently actually, I won't say recently because I actually got this a while ago. But this was the lanyard that I got for Maleficent. I have a, a dragon version of the same blind keychain. I actually ordered these on eBay. Okay, so now I'm gonna move over to my Kingdom Hearts. My Kingdom Hearts collection is actually quite small compared to my others. So, um, like the first thing I actually ever received was, I purchased was not this keychain, but this lanyard. I got this lanyard like a, many, many years ago. Um, I got it at Hot Topic and I also bought this uh, keychain keyblade. And yeah, and um, I bought this uh, Sora keychain. I want to say when Kingdom Hearts 3 first came out, I purchased it. And then, um, so I decided to get the matching keychains too. So I have a Kyrie one, and then I have a Riku one. And then um, this year, I actually got the Tsum Tsum versions of them, which I didn't even know was a thing. I like, yeah, I didn't know. Um, so I have a little Kyrie Tsum Tsum. There she is right here. This is like her in Kingdom Hearts 1. And then I have, this one is 2. I didn't, I don't have anything of them like that looks like they're in 3. But yeah, that have, so there's that. And then I have a Sora Tsum Tsum. I like this one. He has like this little key blade right here. He has a little chain with the Mickey on and his little necklace. And then I have Riku Tsum Tsum. Okay, so... I actually recently purchased, like there's these one keychains that I've been wanting, or phone charms I should say, that I've been wanting forever, but they were like crazy expensive. So in my hunt for these keychains, I ended up coming across this this um, lady on Etsy and she made these other type of keychains and I like them. They're like, they're the trios and I love these, they're so pretty. And it has like the, the symbols, like the wayfinders and stuff like that. So this is the... Wayfinder Trio. Then I have the Sea Salt Gang. This has this actually glows in the dark right here, but it's too bright in here for, for you to see it. And I didn't charge it up, so if I tried to make it glow, it'd be so dark. Yeah, this is Sea Salt Gang. And then this was the Destiny Island Trio. And my hunts, I bought all three of them. Uh, she just made like um, the three. But I like fell in love with these and they're so pretty. So I made sure I got all three of them. And then, so luckily for me, I actually ended up did like eventually getting those keychains or the phone charms that I was looking for that were crazy expensive. I found a seller that was actually selling them for not too expensive. Uh, I got this one on Amazon. This is Kyrie. I think these things came out in like uh, 2009 and they were like a limited edition and like there were only so many that came out. And so now they're like really rare and I, I was actually very lucky to end up coming across the ones that I did. I think there's like 11 of them total, I think. I'm not sure. I could be wrong. But then I eventually got a Sora. I was really happy to get this one. And I also have a Riku one. Yeah. Okay, so this is actually my whole little collection of things that I have. Oh, I forgot to talk about these. I have got this um, when... The Haunted Mansion turned 50. I got this from Hot Topic for, believe it or not, $4. I got it for $4. Um, I saw it and I was like, ooh, I want it. Because Haunted Mansion is actually my favorite ride at Disneyland. I love this ride. Um, if I go on like the ranking of like what my favorite rides are, Haunted Mansion would be like number one, Pirates of the Caribbean number two. And um, I don't know, I'm going to tie between um, Space Mountain and Big Thunder Mountain. Yeah. Uh, I also have this um, water bottle that I got of Kingdom Hearts. Um, I got this on sale at GameStop for $5. 
I think it was like 15 before, but I got it, like it was on like a clearance sale. I liked it. I thought it was so nice. When I, I don't drink out of these. Yeah. I never drink out of my, my collector glasses. So sometimes they just literally sit around collecting dust. So yeah, there's my little small collection of things. I'm pretty sure I'll make another video of other things that I've collected over the years. But for right now, this, this is it. Oh yeah, I didn't even show you my little Tinkerbell one that I made a little cupcake. I have a Maleficent one, but I lost it. It's somewhere in this house. I don't know where, but uh, I'll probably like find it later and then do like an update. Alrighty. Okay, so like um, that's my collection of the little things that I have. I'll probably do it like an update once I have more things, you know, so that's it. Alrighty. Bye.